നമസ്കാരം ഓൺ ഇമ്പോർട്ടൻസ് ഓഫ് കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷൻ ഹൗ ലവ് ആൻഡ് റിലേഷൻഷിപ്പ് കൺസിഡറേഷൻ കമ്പാഷൻ പാഷൻ ഫീലിംഗ് ക്യാൻ ബി എക്സ്പ്രസ്ഡ് ആൻഡ് ഹൗ കമ്മ്യൂണിക്കേഷൻ ഹെൽപ്സ് ടു ബിൽഡ് റിലേഷൻഷിപ്സ് വാട്ട് എ വണ്ടർഫുൾ ടോപ്പിക് വിച്ച് നീഡ്സ് എ ഗ്രേറ്റ് അറ്റൻഷൻ I consider communication in five different forms. One is physical. You have to meet somebody, touch, pat, that makes a great impact when it comes to communication. Any digital phone call on sound doesn't make that impact as much it can make through seeing you physically and touching you hugging you smelling you hearing you all that matters the physical makes lot of difference second one emotional communication sometime you don't have to speak a lot a word is good enough that makes lot of impact how emotionally you are attached to a person showing your anger in the tone in which you speak the sound in which you communicate the way in which you communicate makes a big impact to show how much love you have towards someone that feeling comes from the sound the vibrations the harmony the energy it makes lot of impact either it can be anger or love hatred or love passion or compassion any feeling when it is expressed the way in which it is expressed the feeling comes in your communication word can be the same the way in which you express includes the taste of feeling therefore the other person understands in what mood in what way you communicate it so physical second is emotional the third one is intellectual when you hear a lecture oh you can understand whether it is a blah 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 whether it is coming a superficial mugging up from somewhere putting it across from ghost brain to brain or that person who is communicating to you understood the concept took it as his knowledge and transforming it by grinding it adding his taste adding his style adding his all feelings from it the heart it goes to the heart of the person so it makes lot of effect a effect and e effect i say communication has to be e effective and a effective so it makes though it's an intellectual exercise of teaching someone educating someone creating a learning experience the way in which you communicate matters a lot the third one is a social impact some people have a great power for attracting somebody by the way they communicate i am a good public speaker where i go and speak thousands of people thousands of students maybe the most mischievous their attention power is too less but i am able to capture them because the way in i communicate has got a social impact i relate to them the way in which somebody can relate to the society somebody can communicate in a style in which you can or oh, each individual who listens to you understands oh it is my problem the speaker is talking to me personally but you are talking to a large community and that has got a social impact another one is spiritual 
we listen to somebody not because they are a great speaker the content is too great they have a great feeling towards you but when you think and rethink and rethink over that you grind it yourself you chew it yourself you take some time to understand oh this is what it is it has got an impact in my life so i have to listen to him carefully i have to listen to him with more attention so that it can impact my life i can go inside my thoughts and then capture my own meaning for a better life meaning for making people around me happier i can be a torch bearer with this message which is being given by this person so it makes some impact in my life where i can impact many lives around me that thought becomes a highly spiritual there may not be a great message but but a simple but lot of influence attraction not because it is highly intellectual has got a passion towards you you get binded to him no it's not but there is something which can be a message that can stay in you for longer so physical emotional intellectual social spiritual all this happens when the speaker as a motivator as a person who communicates to people either to an individual to a large mass for a long term or a short term emotional can be short term spiritual can be long term material can be the benefit when you give an intellectual talk to somebody an emotional can be just making them soothing them happy for some time spiritual can be a great value which you communicate to somebody for a large number of people in the society all the different levels happens only when you speak to yourself internally and you create your own intellect to work inside you so there is a researcher inside you that's called a brahma in bharatiya shastra the creativity is what is called a brahma so hridaya guhara madhye kevalam brahma matram inside your hridaya there is a brahma and that brahma works and in bharatiya indian system brahma's wife is considered as saraswati so when you have that creativity the saraswati who is considered as the goddess of education the goddess of communication the vak devi vak means the words which comes from you the words can come from the tongue it can comes from the thought it can come from your chest it can come from your belly it makes it different levels right how deep inside you are and how deep is your communication power that is what the vak devi saraswati who is the goddess of communication for indian system bharatiya system and that will stay in you only when saraswati's husband is brahma creativity is inside you so the more creative you are you are more communicative so you know where when why how what in front of whom to speak and not to speak to communicate and not to communicate a physical touch in front of somebody may be right but when somebody is not there around and you are alone with somebody else you touch them becomes a crime so it all depends on where when why how to whom in front of whom for what purpose what motive you are communicating to somebody so communication is a great skill which needs to be not learned not heard through lectures it is to be observed understood practiced and a good mentor can make you a good communicator a mentor communicates much better to a mentee which may not be applicable or acceptable to most of the other common people also who is close to you as a mentee the mentor speaks oh this is what he means this is what she means oh now i understood it needs a awakening inside you so that the mentor communicates to the mentee very very effectively and it stays in them for long time 
നമസ്കാരം ആൻഡ് പ്രണാംസ്